cześć, siemano, z tej strony Jano z kanału Jano Gra i chciałem Cię serdecznie zaprosić na trzeci odcinek Let's Playa z gry Żywe Trupy sezon drugi. Właśnie udało się nam odnaleźć nową grupę, która nie do końca nas dobrze przyjęła, ponieważ myślę, że jesteśmy ugryzieni przez szwendacza, kiedy zrobił to pies w sumie, a nie szwendacz. Zamknęli nas w szopie i czekają do rana, żeby sprawdzić, czy się nie, nie, przemi nie przemienimy w szwendacza właśnie. A my teraz sobie wydostaliśmy się z tej szopy i idziemy sobie znaleźć materiały, którymi moglibyśmy strzyć naszą ranę na ręce, żeby nie wydało się zakażenie. Jestem właśnie w domu i próbuję sobie znaleźć wodę utlenioną i igłę. Oni mają teraz zabranie domowników i kusą się nieco w kuchni. Tu mamy jakieś drzwi. Pójdźmy na biurko. Obrazek kaczki. Tak. O, i wspomnienie o Daku. Czy nic tu więcej nie ma przypadkiem? Chyba już nic. Czemu nie mogę iść tutaj? Mamy tutaj stół, grali w karty. Użyjmy wyjście. Nie udało się nam znaleźć nic. Może spróbujmy tutaj oknem na tyłach. Nie dostaniemy. A tu już spróbowałem i też się nam nie uda. Także trzeba tam wrócić i przysłuchać się tej rozmowie w kuchni. O, tu jest jeszcze jakieś przejście. Schodami na górę. Coś tam słyszałem. To my tak skrzypimy tymi schodami wchodząc. Otwórzmy drzwi do łazienki. Tutaj może znajdziemy jakieś przybory, żeby strzyć naszą ranę. O. Jest tu igła. 
clean. I'll still need something to keep it from getting infected. Push me up this need. To je stravka. Niestety jest pusta. To się idzie na górę. Ukryjmy się w szafce. Mają wodę w kranie. Czyli ta kobieta ma wątpliwości co do ojcostwa tego dziecka, które nosi. Musimy się stąd wydostać. Wejdźmy do sypialni. O jacie. Jest ta Sara. Zauważyła nas. Możesz mi pomóc? Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Pomóż mi, a nie powiem. Help me, and I won't tell him. I, I'm hurt. Please help me. What? I shouldn't. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurt. Mogę umrzeć, jeśli, jeśli tego nie opatrzę. Clementine. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough. Tak, jesteśmy przyjaciółkami. And then I'll be so cool. Yes, we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? Przyrzekam. I promise. Me too. A pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. Okay. Sara nam pomoże. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry, I won't. We go. Okay, I better get somewhere safer to do this. Okay. Tu jest jeszcze jedna sypialnia. Tak, i co tutaj możemy znaleźć? Tu jest szuflada. Z 
Sem garante. Nie będę go zabierał nikomu. Nie, chcę, nie jestem złodziejem po prostu. Gra planszowa. Nic tu po nas, wychodzimy. Trzeba zejść sobie na dół. Wychodzimy stąd. Oni dalej rozmawiają w kuchni. Wracamy do szopy. No i trzeba będzie zaszyć te rany. Mamy wodę utlenioną. Bandaże, żyłkę i igłę. No i ten sok. This is gonna suck. Spójrzmy na rękę. Podnieśmy wodę utlenioną. Oczyśćmy ranę. Wow. Ale piecze. Weźmy igłę, no wleczmy ją. Udało się. No, just like last time, just how Crystal showed me. No dobra, to szyjemy. Ale boli. Dobra, jeszcze raz. No nie robimy tego najbardziej profesjonalnie jak się da. Okropnie cier cierpimy. Ale miejmy nadzieję, że to nam pomoże i dzięki temu przeżyjemy. Okej. Okay. Ostatni szef chyba.
Dobra, chyba się udało. Okej. Okay. Bolało jak cholera, ale nie jest źle. Zabandażujmy się. Cholera, upuściliśmy. O ja się spędzę. Tutaj mamy grabie. Dobra, nabił się na kotwicę. Weźmy młotek i go załatwmy. I wielki cholera. Teraz mogę wejść do środka. Can I please come inside now? Please. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Nie daliście mi wyboru. You left me no choice. You could have just left. Relax, Rebecca. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Rebecca nas nie nie lubi za bardzo. We better get inside. You hungry? Nawet na Luka się obraziliśmy. Chyba tak miał na imię Luk. Tak z tego co pamiętam. This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. You wouldn't have done what you did. So much not me. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while. You'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. Kiedyś będzie musiała dorosnąć. You do not know what she needs. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else. That your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure: you are not to be trusted. Czyli nawet Carlos tam nie ufa. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Lepiej niż ją stracić. You can say that again. Scars? 
They're way cooler than stumps. Definitely. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. Protecting your friends. I get it. I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just we had a bad experience once. Co się stało? What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Tak. Yeah. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Myślę nad wyruszeniem w dalszą drogę. Thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. You let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but in you look at him knows I'm about other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I I shouldn't have asked. My rodzice wyjechali i już nie wrócili. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter, and they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. So they poznali. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors, and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He told me to stay away from cities. What uh, happened to him? To samo co przytrafia się wszystkim. To everyone, but he saved me first, lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah, he was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in, anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? You're still here. Rebecca nas nie lubi, tak jak już mówiłem. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Maybe you fooled everyone else, but not me. 
Jestem tylko dzieckiem. You know what the hell you're doing. We got enough problems and we don't need any new shit. Get it? I just needed some help. Well, you got it. Now go. Nie zostanę tu długo. Good, because I don't trust you. And stay the hell away from my husband. Wstaje nowy dzień. A my idziemy na ryby z Carlosem, tak jak powiedział. I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. Co ją ugryzło? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, that's sad, yeah, eh? but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. That's oh, now. That's sad. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway. So I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me, and of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. Po prostu chodźmy na drzejkę. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. Auntie, he doesn't hate you. you. Nick's father wasn't there much, and he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line, raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice, Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete. Nick. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. To chyba ci co napadli Krista. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Think about it. Your Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. Okay. Wiecie co? W tym miejscu sobie zakończymy ten odcinek. Dalszą część opowieści sobie już obejrzycie w kolejnym. Dziękuję wam bardzo, że byliście ze mną. Lajkujcie, komentujcie oraz subujcie. I widzimy się w kolejnym odcinku. Trzymajcie się, na razie.